This is uh, our connector system. This is a trunk cable based on a VNTC, which is a type of uh, outdoor rated um, tray cable that doesn't have to be run inside a conduit. It's very lightweight and flexible as you can see and uh, comes in both portrait and landscape configuration. The trunk cable connectors are um, here. This is going uh, from the trunk into a branch that will plug into the microinverter. It has a locking clip as well, <clears throat> so um, they'll be completely locked off and unable to get removed. But uh, even without the locking sir clip, it twists locks and snaps onto the inverter and is, forms a secure connection. This is the trunk termination system. Cap goes on here, and then a self-adhesive silicone tape wraps around the cap to create a completely watertight seal. And then, in addition to trunk terminations, we have branch terminations. The branch termination cap goes onto the end of the branch, locks tight, and for any branches that are left exposed in the install site, um, either temporarily or permanently, these will uh, protect the contacts from, uh, from weather exposure. We also have a simple uh, bolt and mounting kit that you can get um, to um, have one-stop shopping for your hardware needs so that you don't have to go and find uh, other small components to actually mount the inverters on the array. And uh, finally, um, one of the things that we're going to offer is a splicing kit. This one happens to be from TE Connectivity. Um, we also have one from 3M. And this is for when uh, you're wiring together the trunk cable and need to create either an extension or uh, bridge two trunk cables together because of a turn or a gap in the array. So with that, we'll now go into uh, details of the inverter and uh, also some discussions of uh, mechanical installation.